I used to be quiet. Mm. You know I'm saying I wouldn't even say shit. I just I wasn't no people person. Right. Like um, when I used to deal with French, it used to be like he was like go over there and holler at Drake. Mm. Or he was like go over there and holler at Ross. Like these are the people you need to build your own relationship with. They right. know you, my family. And I used to be just in the corner, just quiet. Like he was like play your music, and I'm like. <laughs> and he got the email. Like, what do you think it was? You think it was that you were young? Um, on, 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 I ain't gonna say young. It was just I used to always see myself around a bigger artist and be like, I don't know. I used to get like shook. Like, I mean, talking to Drake, so that's a big thing to just walk on up and be like, "Yo, you might not know about me, but I swear yeah, to God, like, I'm dope." Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the story of the life, story of life. Right. I'm dope, but at the same time, like you know what I'm saying, French definitely set that platform up for me to even. Um, be in the situation I am today. Right. I mean, French, like, I heard a lot of people say, and it really makes sense, he's kind of like the master networker. Like, he will just, he's made so much out of his connections in his gotta, career. You got, you got to give it to French. Yeah. And you got to give it to Rich the Kid. Rich the Kid, too, is another master finesser, yep. 